Hi all. Um, so in this Kafka interview question session, uh, we are going to discuss about one of the interview questions asking how to maintain the order of message in the producer side. Okay, so that's at a high level. Uh, let me get into detail. Okay, so so this is um, this picture right here, right? So this is what the question is all about. Like the producer is sending the message. The first message says it need to insert and then it need to update and then it need to delete. So these are the three messages. Okay, so it need to be processed from insert and then update and then delete. Okay, so we need to make sure. Okay, that insert should always happen first and then the update should happen next and then the delete should happen. This order, you know, should not be collapsed. Okay. So, so the actual scenario here, when the insert fail, okay, we need to make sure like uh, uh, normally what happened when the one of the message fails, the producer will keep, you know, trying to, you know, resend that, but in mean, meanwhile, we will be processing the other messages, right? So, that should not happen. Okay, so the question is about how to maintain how to design the producer in such a way we can maintain the order of the message in the order in which it is sent right even in case of failure right um, so that is all about a question so before getting into the actual solution we need to understand how the messages um, that are posted in the topics okay um, looks like right like how on what basis the messages will be stored in the topic right um let's say okay let's say i have a uh, broker with three topics and my producer is sending three messages okay so in this case okay i cannot guarantee okay which message will be going to which topic okay because it is chosen based on a round robin basis right and also when a consumer consume this top messages okay i cannot guarantee the consumer who is consuming the topic one will be processing the first right i cannot guarantee that too okay so the recommended approach here okay if you want to maintain the order of your data okay order of your message the recommendation is go with a one partition right one topic never go with a multiple topics okay so go with a one partition right so in that way the messages will always send to one partition in the order which the producer sent right so the first message will be insert update and delete so that is a recommendation uh, recommended approach okay but there is a constant this approach in this uh, design because with one topic okay we are going to trade off the latency right yes all the messages are there in one topic okay even though on the consumer group side we have five or ten consumers only one consumer can work on that particular topic the other consumers are idle right so that consumer may take long time to process all these messages and that end up in getting the um very late acknowledgement right so that is why we are telling that um we may end up in high latency if we go with the one uh, partition okay so if still your application demand okay that we need to maintain the order of message along with very good latency along with you no know, we need a partitions right we need that multiple partitions okay, um, to have a high throughput okay we cannot trade off the throughput but we still need a order of the message so so if that is you, what your application want okay 
it is achievable okay but a slight change you want to do on the messaging side okay you want to associate a key with your message okay so like this picture right here so with this message i am setting a key called shop one okay so what the broker do okay there is a partitioner in the broker side which send all the messages with a particular key okay to a particular topic based upon the hash code of the key okay let's say this one is the hash code of shop one is one and the hash code of shop two is two hash code of shop three is three so one may go to topic one all the messages with hash code one goes to topic one all the messages with shop code two goes to topic two and like for likewise for so, so topic three okay so this way you are achieving two things okay you are able to have a very good latency and you are maintaining your order okay so um so this is a um this is a basic fundamental of this is a fundamental of how we are um, um maintaining the order of the message in across any topics okay now okay let's come to let's discuss about the actual problem right so what happened if the insert fail right <coughs> by default what happened right if the insert fail okay if the insert fail let's say my procedure is sending the message in asynchronous mode okay so in that case if the insert fail okay the producer will retry to send this message but meanwhile the other messages will be processed by the consumers right so this is going to be there but the delete is published and tabigon will consume and the consumer who is reading all the um, data from topic one right he will be consuming uh, processing the delete so okay so that's a default behavior okay so we need to stop you know that behavior right as per our requirement the first message which was sent by the producer need to be processed before processing the second message right so for that um the solution is we can we need to do we need to configure few things in the kafka side okay so one of the configuration is okay request to pair connection equal to one what this what is this request per connection means okay this controls how many messages the producer will send to the server without receiving response so we are telling the producer to send only one messages to the server without receiving the response okay so only one messages will be sent at a time okay also we need to set there is another configuration cost called retry we need to set that to true and we need to say how many retries we can do okay so based upon that if the insert is failed it keeps retrying right and unless like it keeps retrying unless the insert is processed okay um the delete won't be published in the topic okay so so with this configuration we are making sure okay we should be processing insert before processing the delete okay also there is another configuration called request per session which is equal to one that ensures that additional messages won't be sent while message batch is retrying means the additional messages like delete won't be sent while the insert you know which which is actually failed when we try retrying to process it we, the delete message won't be sent okay right so how to maintain the order of the message in the producer side right so this is how we need to set all this configuration to maintain the order okay uh, thank you